all-new Lexus LS Hybrid will make its debut in at the Geneva Auto Show next month as the fifth-generation flagship attempts to regain lost ground among full-size luxury sedans. And the model designation of the new hybrid, LS 500H, indicates a change of tactic for Lexus. Toyota won't yet say what's powering the LS 500H, but given how much the new LS shares with the 2018 LC Coupe, we'll bet our Nakamaki tape decks that this car will use the LC 500H's Atkinson Cycle 3.5-liter V6, two electric motor, generators, and a four-speed planetary gear set that manages to mimic both a conventional 10-speed automatic transmission and a continuously variable automatic CVT. Total net horsepower in the 2018 LC500H stands at 354, which is down from the 2018 LS500's 415 and the previous LS600HL's 438 horsepower. The old LS Hybrid was the sole Lexus Hybrid to rock a V8, and it really didn't improve performance or fuel economy over the standard LS460. We also see the LS 500H missing the capital L from its model name, due to the fact that Lexus is going with a single body size, rather than short and long wheelbase versions, for the new LS. When the first LS 600HL launched for 2008, the long wheelbase 600 was aimed at the German Kingpins, the Mercedes-Benz S600 and the BMW 760 Lee. Lexus never played the efficiency card with that model, instead, the idea was to provide V12 shove with the fuel economy of a V8 and the electric silence of a Toyota Prius in city traffic. But that combination had limited appeal. Last year, only about 40 buyers signed up for the LS 600HL, less than 1% of all LS sales. Hybrids may command only a sliver of the market, but with BMW and Mercedes-Benz now selling plug-in versions of their big sedans, it makes sense for hybrid pioneer Toyota once again to put a gasoline-electric setup into its flagship model. This time, though, Lexus appears to be pushing efficiency rather than V12 wannabe performance. We'll know more when the LS 500H makes its debut next month.